The moment you stand up and you understand what God has done for you is the moment when you begin to live in victory. If only they had known. If only those stupid children of Israel had realized what God had done in the hearts of all the other people. Hey, if you've got no heart for war and no heart for a fight, and you're already terrified and petrified and ossified and whatever elseified, and there you are, and you're feeling, goodness me, it can't be. Do you know, all they were waiting for was the Israelis to come and kill them. It was that simple. There was no way the children of Israel could be defeated. Glory to God. Isn't that wonderful? Well, don't you find that wonderful? If only they had known, they wouldn't have spent 40 years living on manna. They could have gone in and they could have had the good life. Instead, they wandered about in the wilderness. My, if only they'd known. <laughs> and this is old covenant. This isn't the promises in Christ. This is old covenant. And it's left for our example. Paul says in Corinthians, you know, for a, an example, so you can understand what's true. My, we're here on the earth to make a difference. We're salt, we're light. That's what's so wonderful. We have a God who's almighty. And Almighty God has given us victory. Uh, look, look at it again. Look at this. Here's, here's a, a woman of ill repute living upon the wall. Uh, and she takes these two spies in. She hides them. I, it excites me because I think it, 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 if that, you know, there she is. And she says, hey, you need to understand the real heart of your enemies. See, when, when, when they realize you're a Christian, you absolutely finish them. Because they know when you're a born-again, spirit-filled believer, they know there's nothing they can do against you. They can't wipe out your belief. They can't conquer you they can't do anything to you in fact they know you are the victor over them a man what a terrible thing they're, they're, they're finished absolutely finished look at it <laughs> I know, she says, verse 9, that the Lord have given you the land. What did she know? It's yours. I know. Not one of those children of Israel knew it. Forty years they've fuffed around. Do you know, this woman had more faith than the whole bunch of them. It was faith in their disaster. She said, look, she said, I know the Lord hath given you the land and that your terror is fallen upon us and all the inhabitants of the land faint because of you. And that's what I, I know that. If only they'd known. And, and, and do you understand? It's what you don't know that destroys you. My people perish for lack of knowledge. If you knew, but you don't, you know why you're getting bothered? You don't know. If you knew, if you understood, but you don't. 
children of Israel were living in fear. Oh, they're giants in the land. You know, they'll all, we'll be like grasshoppers. No. We know God's given you the land. Hey, it's yours. We know it's your inheritance. For we have heard how the Lord dried up the water of the Red Sea for you 40 years ago and she's still telling them there's not one person who's prepared to stand against them because they know they've had it. And for 40 years they didn't realize. When you came out of Egypt and what he did and what ye did unto the two kings of the Amorites that were on the other side of Jordan, Sion and Og, whom you utterly destroyed. And as soon as we heard these things, our hearts did melt. Neither did there remain any more courage in any man because of you. Hey, how, how does that make you feel? How does, look, this is an example left for our instruction, says Paul in Corinthians. How does that make you feel? How does it make you feel? Huh? When you realize that when God promises you something and promises you an inheritance, I'll tell you, the whole of creation bows to God's will. Everything that opposes God is quaking. Do you know when Jesus came to earth and walked the earth, he just had to walk down a place and people fell down and the devils cried out, Oh, you come to torment us before? Hey, they already knew their end was that. <laughs> they, they realized that was it. <laughs> 